Fishermen have joined up with a Buddhist group to release a large number of valuable fish back into the ocean off Penghu. To mark Mother's Day, the female cobia were released back to freedom in a traditional life release ceremony. In recent years, overfishing has threatened the ecology of Penghu's waters. Experts say the event will have a meaningful impact on local marine ecology. May is the breeding season for cobia. This life release ceremony was organized by a religious association in conjunction with Penghu Fishermen's Association. The cobia thrash around in the net, but they're not headed for the market. They're being let free into the ocean in a symbolic affirmation of the preciousness of life. A 15 to 25 kilogram female cobia can produce 3 million eggs. So from a marine ecology conservation standpoint, these life release ceremonies are very meaningful. The fish were brought to a safe area and the net opened. Immediately, they were back at home. Some unknown boats gathered, perhaps tourists or opportunistic fishermen. In the last two years, the farming of valuable fish like cobia has grown as an industry in Penghu. It's a new site for the area, but overfishing is a threat to the cobia's future. This Buddhist group hopes the event will help the fish maintain their place in the local ecology. <laughs> Our project to rescue and release these cobia moms is an attempt to express our deepest friendship and deepest respect for Mother Nature and to express our equal love for all beings as Buddhists. We want to nurture the ocean from generation to generation. This is just the first cobia release series organized by the Buddhist and fishermen's groups. Experts say it represents releasing 1.3 billion eggs into the ocean. Time to coincide with Mother's Day, the ceremony was a gesture for fish mothers and for Mother Earth.